I have a brother, his name is Victor. He's my whole life, he's everything to me. I will give up my life for him. He has Down syndrome. And what people don't understand about kids like those, special needs, is one word that always strikes me and it strikes so many in the heart and it puts us through so much pain. It puts us in a dark room and we can't even think and that's the only thing we can feel is just pain. And the word is retarded. People use retarded like it, it's nothing and, and, and it's not nothing. It is a word that really impacts a lot of people. Just like some people say gay for no reason. You can't. It, 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 you, some people don't know what those words are and you haven't experienced what we have. And when you say that, even if you're joking, or, or if you're just messing around with your friends, or you can say, I don't mean it, whether you mean it or you're joking, or you're just saying it out loud randomly, it hurts other people without you knowing. You don't know how badly it hurts us. For me, the, that, that's the one word, it's retarded, because of my brother. I'm Glenn Thompson, School Climate and Relational Approach Consultant for CCRCE. Too often, people say words and they don't consider the hurtful impact they have on others. We need to change this and raise awareness that words matter. Here's what you have to do. Go find our other five posters related to Stand Up Speak Out, scan the QR code, and hear five important stories. Join us on September 13th to deepen this conversation. Remember, everyone has a story and words matter.